You know, at six tonight, the clock may be ticking for a coastal bend fisherman's favorite. And now one group claims that the Port of Corpus Christi is to blame. Despite being damaged by hurricane winds, it is still a popular destination to drop a line in the water and hope for a catch. Here's Indian Point Pier, which is the focus of this battle. The city of Portland owns the pier, but the port owns the land underneath. In 1990, the port granted a 30 year lease for the pier. And if you do the math, that lease is up for renewal. A group calling itself Portland Citizens United posted this on Facebook. The claim that the port is threatening to close the pier if the mayor does not support economic development plans. So we reached out to port CEO Sean Strawbridge, who says the Portland group's claims are far from the truth. A statement from Strawbridge reads in part, quote, we have every reason to believe that we will reach an agreement with the city on the terms and conditions of this valuable property, which the Port Authority recognizes is important for recreational and fishing uses. Now, Portland City Manager Randy Wright responds, the current lease renewal proposed by the port includes certain requirements and limitations that are not acceptable to the city of Portland. But Wright adds that the city is in negotiations with the port to correct those terms. And you can read their full statements on our website, ChrisTV.com. Something important to note is that the terms of the current lease will be effective until a new lease is signed. Meantime, the Port Commission is expected to have a meeting on April 20th.